Okay, now it looks like he, uh, if this is, this looks like it might be the original. There is some kind of a butyl, uh, kind of a tape here uh, that comes down, but it ends about here, you know, about a quarter of the way down the, the front slope. So I'm guessing that uh, all he did was put this gobs of uh, silicone uh, up and down this and did not put, to my suspicion, did not put any kind of a tape or um, a sealer other than <laughs> his little beads of, of caulk along the sides of this. I would not call that a, a true repair. I would call that sloppy work. I would call that uh, cutting corners. And um, what should be on the rest of this uh, we see up here, and again, uh, my suspicion is that that's probably the original from uh, from the manufacturer. And uh, so Miller's um, RV in Honeybrook certainly um, took the short corner on this one, and um, and I'm now paying for it. Thanks, guys. Okay, we're looking at. Uh, to the rest of his right side, took off this side molding, and again he didn't take off the, uh, didn't peel back the, the factory uh, seal. This butyl, what I call butyl tape, whatever this putty tape is. Um, all he did when he replaced it was um, put this silicone bead along here, which really didn't help uh, anything a whole lot. So um, again. Um, no tape, no flashing tape, no kind of any, any kind of uh, sealant.